Hello guys, it's Riker. So Burnley versus uh, Liverpool, man. Liverpool were able to win this game 3-0. And with this win, Liverpool are back in the uh, Champions League's position. Uh, tie on points with Leicester City, 66 points. But goal differentiation put them above Leicester City, man. So one more game. And I'm not sure what they're playing. I think they're playing a very easy team, man. A, a game that they should win. They should win. So we're going to see how that goes. Leicester City uh, playing... Uh, they're playing a tough team too, man. I believe they're playing Spurs or one of those teams. So, um, Leicester City always butcher it, man. They always flop at the end, man. We saw what Manchester United did last year. Knock them out of the Champions League. And it's looked like Liverpool are going to do it this year, man. They always flop at the end. Uh, they won an FA Cup, so they're satisfied with that. Probably Europa League again for them, man. But Liverpool, I think, going to get Champions League football next year. And shout out to them for that. Very good game overall. Um, Burnley, had, Burnley had some opportunities, man, because um, Liverpool dominated the game when it comes to possession. They had more shots. They created way, way more chance opportunities than, than, less, than uh, Burnley. But Burnley had more shots on target. Liverpool was very precise and was on target. Three shots on target and three goals in general, man. I was very impressed by Nathan uh, Williams. Um, he had a goal and he, he had a goal line clearance and he was very good defensively. Um, Robertson, he had a, he had two freaking um, two assists. Uh, Mane had two assists. Firmino started scoring again. He scored an opening goal in the in the forty third minute. Then uh, Nathan Williams scored a second goal for Liverpool in the fifty uh, third or fifty second minute. And then it was Austin Chamberlain man, coming off the bench and scoring the third goal for Liverpool in the 88 minute man. So good win for Liverpool. And they're looking like they more than likely they're going to qualify for Champions League, man. So the season not over for them. I think they're going to come back stronger next year. Um, they're going to be better next year, man, because the... Um, the the schedule is going to be different, man. The schedule is not going to be tight as how it was this year. I don't think they're going to have as much injury as this year. And Van Dyke pretty much is going to be back next year, man. So shout out to everybody out there. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a like. Leave a comment. I'm out of here, though. Peace.